it is time. What time is it? You may ask. The time it is. It's is time. That's right. None other than Godzilla time. I actually would have these much earlier. By much earlier, I mean like two days earlier. But the guy, the delivery guy, came when I wasn't home and he needed a signature. So I was like, oh, I had to wait two extra more days for redelivery. But nonetheless, the time is still now. Godzilla time. I bought 10 extra boosters. You can't really tell from this angle, but trust me, there's 10 here. Okay. All right. Now, usually I would do my, uh, you know, like two, two boxes per video, totaling up to five videos. But not this time. This time I'm going to make two videos. And you're going to be asking, wow, Kingpin, why? Why is that? Why two videos? Well, because I'm lazy and making five videos takes a long time. Ain't nobody got time for that. But mainly because I'm just lazy. So we're going to open five boxes now and then five boxes in the next one. So what I'll do is I only really read the card effects once for every new rare and higher rarity that we get. Just so I don't drag on these two videos since they're going to be extraordinarily long videos. But yeah, so five boxes in this first one. Please excuse my non-Godzilla mat. I don't have a Godzilla mat. But it's fine, it's whatever. It's because we're not here for the mats. We're here for the Godzilla. Uh, Setting up my uh, laptop on the side of me for translations because this is a Jap. Okay, we're good. We're good. Got my translations to the side of me. This is a Japanese set exclusive to Japan, so we're not, we're not gonna get a English version of Godzilla, unfortunately. But you know, it's okay. We'll we'll make do with the Japanese version. Here's how uh, the the box looks like. It's got a cool little art there. Not. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Ooh, Mecha got in the back there. I kind of didn't notice him. So what can we expect from this? Uh, two sick rares. Three SPs. 50 foils, I think. Uh, six double R's, 12 rares. 12 uncommons, and 20 commons. All right, hopefully we get that sick Godzilla rare. That'd be pretty freaking awesome. You know what I'm saying? Like in general, all of these cards are like pretty fun to make. Like the Godzilla red mono red deck. Ooh, that looks pretty fun. Unfortunately, there's no level one combo, so it kind of sucks. But you know, we'll make do. The human decks are pretty fun too. Mecha Godzilla definitely puts in that work. I'm not the big fan of the green cards though. The green cards seem kind of lackluster in my opinion. But uh, yeah, six packs per box. All right, so let's go on to the first one. So you can start off strong with an SP. I'll move this trash can I got over here a little closer for easier trashing. All right. Oh yeah, this is an extra booster. Oh, okay, this is our rare right here. So I'll read what it does. Peaking interest, Miana. During your attack phase, you can now return characters from the waiting room to your hand via your own card effects, aka no red climaxes. And with this place on hand stage, if there are far more climax cards in your opponent's waiting room, rest this card. Oh, here's our foil. Yeah, I'll put it the right there. Oh, very nice. Oh, oh, we have to get two foils per box. That's right. That's right. Extra boosters. Oil privilege. So this is the new weird. This is my first time buying an extra booster with the new format ratios. So I don't really know what to expect. Oh, here's our first double R. It's the green one. Of course, I said I don't care for the green cards, and I start getting all the green cards. Exactly how it works. Brave Shrine Maiden, Miana. If there are two of your climaxes in your waiting room, this gets minus one level in your hand. When this place from hand stage, you can put a tuck clock into the waiting room. And when you're the character that is either green or a ratrum, aka a human character, this front attack, you may put pay one, put this card in your waiting room. If so, return that character to your hand. So you return the card that's getting front attacked to your hand. 
by paying one and killing that green card. Here's our foil. Ooh, we got a foil climax. Ooh. Ah. Cool. Cool, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Ow, my hand. Okay. Ooh, our rare is this weird looking Godzilla here. Start advancing Godzilla Earth at the start of your attack phase. If you have another ruler of Earth, Godzilla Earth, choose one of your kaiju characters. Okay, one of these creature like things. And that character gets X power. X equals 1000 times the number of characters with the same name as that character you selected. Nice. Power up those army cards. Okay, that's all Godzilla got. And then pay one rest of your kaiju characters for the top four cards of your library into the waiting room. There's at least one pterodactyl type creature, serve them, or sudden mutation, serve them among them. Search library for up to one kaiju character with it, put it in your hand, shuffle library. So if you reveal one of those um, army cards from the trial deck, you get to search your deck for a trial on oh, no, your waiting room, right? No, search your library for a kaiju. Nice. Nice. Oh, we got a rare foil. Ooh. Number this guy? 25. Rekindled Civilization. Galugu. Oh, you're the character with Mecha Godzilla in name. Getting the following ability. This card, this can't be chosen by your target or your opponent's effects. And pay one rest this Brainstorm for each common mass. Choose up to one character with either Mecha or Arachnum. Return to your hand. Oh, nice. We got another foil climax. Yo, this looks great. What the? Is this Godzilla shooting a giant laser beam at something? Yo, that's amazing. That's actually amazing. Can I get four of that foil? That'd be freaking sweet. Ooh, nice. We got level three rare over here. Wings of Migratory Bird, Yuko Tani. When it's a place from hand of stage, drop the two cards and discard a card from hand in waiting room. And change. At the start of your climax phase, you may return this to your hand. If so, choose an armored weaponary vulture in your hand and put it in the slot this was in. Oh, cool. We got a rare foil Godzilla. Dude, look. Check this guy out, man. If I were walking down a dark alley in the middle of the night and ran to this guy, I'd be like, nope. Turning around immediately. Ain't having none of that. When's the place final stage? You may put the top card clock into waiting room. Oh, this card's called Scarlet Colored Godzilla Earth. Uh, second effect: Star activate. Put two kaiju characters from stage into your waiting room. If so, draw a card. So kill two kaiju's and you draw a card. And then last one. Also activate. You pay one. Choose a fierce roar Godzilla Earth in your level zone and swap it with this card. Which is the other level 3 Godzilla. Ugh. Okay, there we go. Then we get the army card for green as our other foil. Alright. Let's see. Oh, wait. This, guy's a this guy is a rare? Are you kidding me? Cold Realist Dolo, uh, Dolu Do? Yeah, Dolu Do. Let's go with that. And that's attacks at the level of the character opposite this is 3 or higher. This gains plus 6k for the turn. And discard a character Encore. So is that really a rare? Like really? Oh, guys, yes, We got the Vulture level 3 double R foil. Yo, this card is sick, dude. Look at this card. Oh my gosh. So check this card out, guys. Check out what this card does. Armored Weaponry Vulture. That's the one this level 3 changes into. When this is placed from hand to stage, put up to one card from the top of your clock into the waiting room. And choose up to one character in the waiting room and put it face up under this as a marker. Now you want to be very careful what marker you put. Because that marker does matter. Climax come when this attacks. If all units sorte is in your climax zone, perform the following action. If the marker of this character with Haru in name, deal one damage to your opponent. 
And if the marker of this is a character with Yuko in name, put the top card of the library in your waiting room, slow one lower card, two up to five cards, in your opponent's waiting room, return to your library, and your opponent shuffles that library. So yeah, you want to mark either a Haru or a Yuko. That's Yuko. We haven't have a Haru out here in the field yet. Oh, nice! And I get the... I think this is a Climax foil for the Vulture. Let me let me check. Let me check. Uh, yes, yes, it is. Oh, baby. Oh, mama. Yo, those cards look sick. I'm so glad I bought this set. What are these cards? I don't know what these cards, but they're over here. Oh, I know what these cards are. Hold on. Hold the phone. Hold the phone, guys. I mixed up my foils with my non foils. Yeah. 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 Okay, there we go. Fixed. Nobody panic. It is fixed. Oh, wait. Hold on. Oh, there we go. Yeah, yeah, we go. All right. Nice. Nice pull there. Nice pull there, me. Yes, thank you, me. That was really good. Oh, nice. We got the brainstorm. Four humans. No more wavering Haru. Oh, here. Here's Haru, by the way. At the start of your economics phase, you may look at the top card library. Put it back where it was. You just can do that every third economics phase. And then pay one rest this to put top four cards library for each climax. Search library for the one green or a Ratrum character. Ooh, our foil is the 1-1 one, one event for green. But I'm not going to play green, so unfortunate. And this guy with the alarm that I think it's not worth. Oh, that was the last box. I mean, packing that box. All right, so we get one, two, two, three, three double rares per box. And then one, two, three, four, five, six rares. Oh, yeah, because there's six packs. Okay, let me just make sure I didn't miss any rares or double rares. This is my first time buying an extra booster with the new ratios. So, yeah. Three double R's and six rares per extra booster. Okay, all right. Good to know. Good to know. Oh, hold on, guys. Let me uh, adjust something. Okay, uh, sorry for the shaking. There's something on the camera. There we go. That I had to remove. And now to struggle with the wrapping because I never remember to bring scissors ever. Or at least something sharp and pointy. All right, second box. No SP. But no worries. We still got nine boxes. That's 54 packs. We got plenty of chances. Plenty. All right, here's our rare. Did we get this rare? We did, so I'm not going to read it again. Ooh, we didn't get this rare, and it's a foil too. Oh, it's wait, no, it's this guy right here, right? Number twenty-eight. Yep, number twenty-eight. All right, well, put the foil on top of him, and we get this guy full. All right, so yeah, remember, I'm only gonna read the effects once per card, as to save time, since I'm opening five boxes per video. I don't want to make this video too long. Oh, nice. We got the brainstormer again. First double R. Got a nice Godzilla on common foil. Nice. Ooh, we haven't gotten this one foil. Looks like a toy robot. Like one of those Gundams you build. I'm mixing up my non foils and foils again. Dang it, me. I had one job. One job. I'm screwing it up. Uh. Over there. Okay, there we go. Fixed it yet again. All right, so one double R down. Then this box. <laughs> what? Why is this a rare? All right, so this rare is just your standard 2K backup that we all know and love. Biologist. Martin. Uh, 1k backup, and when you use this backup of this, if you have a character that is either green or red charm, choose one of your characters in battle, and that character gains 1,000 power for the turn. AKA, it's gonna be 2k backup. Oh, okay, here's a rare climax combo. Foil version. Spiral of Suspicions, Haru. 
Uh, when this is placed from hand to stage, you may discard a climax. If so, choose a character in your waiting room. It's either green or red drum. Turn it to your hand. And when this attacks, if the determination to the front lines of your climax zone scans the following ability until the next end of your opponent's turn. When it's a front attack, you may return this card to your hand. And I got this common guy. Well. See, I don't know if that's worth a climax slot. Just to return a level zero to your hand every time. Seems not worth. Definitely seems not worth. Well, I mean, you can pull off some fun stuff with it, I guess. But it's just like better things to do. Oh, finally! All right, here's the man, the myth, the legend himself. Look at that three cost fierce roar, Godzilla of Earth. That's the one this guy swaps with. Uh, continuous bodyguard. Just you know, has it out at all times. Experience. If the sum of the level cards in level zone is four or higher. And you have no other characters. This gains plus 10,000 power. And the following two abilities. Continuous. This cannot be chosen as your target of your opponent's effects. And Climax Combo. When the Heat Ray is placed in your Climax Zone, you may pay three. Discard three Kaiju cards from your hands to the waiting room. If so, choose up to two of your opponent's characters. Put them in clock in any order. And perform the following effect twice. Deal five damage to your opponent. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that's a, uh, now that's a card. That is a very spicy meatball card. Dang, I'm putting that every time, I keep forgetting. Get over the non foils. Man, if I can get the sec rare of that card, oh, it's gonna be so good. It looks so good. Hope I can show it off to you guys by getting it. But it's so freaking good oh nice we got mecha godzilla initiating mecha godzilla for each marker in this this gains plus 1000 power when this attacks put the talk card library face up under this as a marker and climax common when this attacks if multiplication cities in your climax zone you may discard a card from hand waiting room put two markers from under this into the waiting room if so deal four damage to your opponent and activate or auto i mean when this is attacked you may pay three put three markers from this into the waiting room if so choose a card in your waiting room put it at the top of your library aka just put a just grab a climax card in your library or in your waiting room put it on the top of your library guaranteed cancel every time all right we got a the double r level one climax combo for green it's the foil version too during attack phase you can now return characters from waiting room to your hand via your own card effects and Climax come with attacks of praise to the eggs in your Climax zone. And there are six or three cards in your hand. Look at the top to three, up to three cards on the top of your library. Search up to one character that is either green or a trim. Really up your hand, put the rest in the room. So it's a pretty good combo. But I don't feel like running green just to run that combo. Because the green cards are kind of like whatever. So like that card and like the level three card, that's pretty much it. I can barely see him. I guess I'll move him uh, right here. Yeah, same with Vulture. Yeah. Uh, well, I mean, yeah, you can see him fine. That's fine. All right, this is the last pack. Last pack. Did we get three double R's this one? So we got him, him, and her. Okay. So we got all our double R's. Ooh, there's our rare. What? This is a rare? Are you serious? You know, some of the ra rarities for these cards, I, I don't know, Bushiru. Directing Battle Haru. When this place from hand to stage, this gains plus X power for the turn. X equals 500 times the mother. Times the number of your characters that are green or a ratrum. So at max, it'll be 7,500. This is the last card you put on the field. Got the foil event again. And the foil of this card. But I don't see. Okay, yeah. All right, good, 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 good. How was that box? Second box down. Third box. 
running out of space. Maybe try to zoom down in my camera a little more. Maybe I'll do it in the next video because I'm not going to adjust it now. It's too late. Too late. Okay. 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 Uh, rare. All right. The Brainstorm Godzilla. We got it right. Yeah, he's right there. Found the Uncommon Godzilla. And the Common of whatever this guy is. As our foils. Oh, man, did I put the... Dang. One of these days, I uh, will remember not to put the non-foils in the foil stack. There we go. I'm just so used to it because I, I never really open extra boosters. So like the regular boosters, I just put the cards to my right side. You know? Oh, here's the Mecha Godzilla Climax combo. Common. Oh, another rare of the Earth Godzilla. Non foil. Let's put it over here. Oh, whoa, look at this one. Oh, this is the back row for Mecha Godzilla that gives it markers. Yo, that foil though. Oh, we got another Vulture Climax combo of foil. Sick, nasty dude. We is in there, my guy. Nice, the double there's Vulture, not the foil, but we already got a foil, so can't complain. Her as a foil, another foil is I don't know which climax combo was for this one, but uh looks nice. Looks nice. Looks nice. Alright. All right. Next one. Oh, here's our rare. Have we got the guy before? I don't think we have. Uh no. No, we have not gone this rare. Well, yes, we have. Yeah, that's the brainstormer. It's the Mecha Godzilla brainstormer. Bam! Oh, this card. This card. Let me read you this card, and you'll be like, "Whoa! Why is that? Why is that a double R? That is not double R worthy." Only hope Yuko Otani. And there's a text just when you're a Ratchet character. That character gains plus 1500 power for the turn. Yeah, so far pretty. Not double art worthy. And at the start of your encore phase, if you have no other rested characters in your front row, you may pay one if so rest this. Like that's it. That's all it does. And you're making that a take up a double art slot. Bushy Road, what are you doing? Stop it. Stop it. We both know that ain't double art worthy. Oh, here's the rare. Have we gotten this green rare? Yes, over here. Oh, we got the level 3 rare with this blonde haired guy. This card is really good, actually. And it's the foil version. Archbishop Metpheus. Assist all your characters from this game. Plus X power. X equals 1000 times the level of that character. During your opponent's turn, when damage taken by you isn't cancelled, we got talk card library, put it either on the top of your library or in the waiting room. And rest this, look at the top two cards on the top of your library, put them on the top of your library in the same order. And look at the top two cards on the top of your opponent's diary and put them back in the same order. So yeah, this card has some... This card can win you games, man. Just when you think you're like, oh man, I'm just gonna lose the next hit. It's gonna be terrible. And you look at the top card, you'll be like, oh... I don't need this is a card that's this is not a climax straight to the waiting room and then they attack you then you reveal the top card and it's a climax you're like whoa the place MLG oh crazy yeah yeah don't underestimate that card plus it gives tons of power for no reason we <laughs> got the backup as a rare here oh we got the foil wait we don't have this one yet uh, no, we don't. All right, so I'll read it for you guys. Going together, Miana. Assist all your characters in this game, plus finder power. And when your character trigger checks, 
They listen closely. Resident of Hotua. Choose one of your characters that card against Dust Power for the turn. It's the green army card. So if you trigger reveal a green army card, you get a character when your character is a thousand power. Oh, cool! Look how cool this foil one looks. It's a level 2 climax combo. That can be used as your level 1 climax combo because it is a level 1 hand. Alright, did we get three double rares again? One, two, and then I got a vulture. Oh, yeah, and her. God dang it. Why is she a double R? Why you do this, Bushy Road? Oh my gosh. This one is more open. Okay. Alright. Got it open. Still no SP. Still no Godzilla sick rare. It's gotta be in here somewhere. It's gotta be. Huh? Hold on. There we go. Alright, who's our first rare? Oh, it's the Mecha Godzilla Brainstormer. Rare is the blonde hair dude, the uncommon. Oh, we got the follow of her again. I'll take it. I'll take it. A 100 absolutely take. Okay. Man, this feels so weird only opening six boxes in each pack. Feels so little. Just so little. No! Wasted double R! Dang it, that could have been a vulture or a Godzilla. I hate everything. Comment in the common foils. It's not even foil version either. I hate this box already. Oh, this is a uh, sec Godzilla rare in here. It's the only way to redeem yourself the box. Only right. Oh, okay, I'll take a vulture foil as well. I'll take that. I'll take that. Have I only gotten one of this Godzilla? Oh, I have. Uh oh. Come on, give me at least three. Ideally four. I'll take full place. In fact, just give me four. Let's go with that. Yeah. Oh, here's a Godzilla Earth again. Oh, nice! We got a foil of him! Again! Whose name I keep forgetting? Oh, it's like Metaphius or something like that. Ugh. Okay. Ooh, rare. Of Yukotani. <sighs> rare of that one. Ooh, a foil of the Vulture! Maybe I think I only need one more. Oh, the Vulture Climax card, foil. To make a full place of foil Vulture Climaxes. There we go. These stacks get too big. Too big for their own bridges. Okay. Okay. Our rare is a rare. That shouldn't be a rare. Now, oh, whoa, there's the SP. We got an SP. I'm not that hyped because it's the green SP. So it's god dang it of all the SPs. All right. You know what? We'll take it. I guess. Ooh, textured. Ooh, it looks really good though. It looks really freaking good. Look at that pattern. That's a nice pattern. I like that pattern. It's a good pattern. I approve of this pattern. Uh, uh, there we go. In the foil. All right. Well, we get it. We got an SP. We got two double R's that I do not care for, unfortunately. So that box was a kind of a met box. That was a met box for me. Because we got two green double R's. I don't mean sorry. One green double R that happened to be the SP. Her as the other double R. And Vulture. Yeah, Vulture was the third one. It was foil. So, you know what? We'll take it. We'll take it. We don't complain about SPs here on this channel. All right? Okay? We we are grateful for the SPs we receive. So I'll take that SP, put it in a binder, and just leave it there. And show it off to people. And hopefully someone will buy it off me. The dream. Ah, oh, dang it. What did I say about green SPs?
Or green double R's, I mean. Stop it. I don't want them. Okay, uncommon foil, and that common card has foil as well. Have we gone every rare and double R? I think we have. Foil? Nope. Rare? Alright, definitely have enough of this guy, that's for sure. Oh, rad! He got a foil vulture! That's what I'm talking about. Gotta stop putting these cards. <laughs> Where is this Godzilla card? I only got one in. So it's gonna be five boxes soon here. I have one more double R in this box. Please don't be something bad. Uh, this card. Where are you at? There you are. Ooh, she's high fiving herself. That's a pretty cool skill. That is a, a skill not to be reckoned with. The ability to high five yourself. Okay, this is the rare. Ooh, we got a four rare. Ooh, and the foil for the level zero climax combo. Come on, two more packs. Please be the level three Godzilla double R. Only got one mecha Godzilla too. What is this? What is this madness? That card's only a rare. Push your old, please. God, why? Oh, why is it this guy again too? Where did this card go? It goes here. Oh wait, hold on, hold on a second. This one goes here. This one goes here. That's okay. I messed that up. And this one's here. Yes, yes. All right, last. What trip? What double R is it, guys? This is the last pack of these five boxes. Come on, Godzilla. Come on, Godzilla. Come on, Godzilla. Oh, it's a rare. Eh? Did I get three double R's already? I feel like I missed out on a double R. I am quite sad. Let's go over here. Do that. And the foil. Yeah, that's all the packs. Hmm. Maybe I did get three double R's. So I wasn't paying attention. Or not. Oh, that was five boxes. Got a full play set of vultures. Yeah, three, three foils. Got one SP. One Mega Godzilla and one. What is this Godzilla called? Fierce War Godzilla. Can you believe that? Like, what the heck? In five boxes. This is not good. I do not want to buy Godzilla singles. Please stop it. Those, the next five boxes better be worth, guys. I'm going to cry if I don't get at least two more of those Godzillas. Preferably three. Alright guys, well, that's it for this one. Thank you for watching. Don't worry, we still got five more boxes. Just be sure to stay tuned for when those go up. But until then, peace out guys.